hi totally impromptu live i didn't even plan this live training but i am going to give you the perfect pitch formula in here okay so stay tuned what i'm talking about today is going to shift the whole way in which how you actually sell your offer so if you've seen a huge slump in your offers especially slump in your sales especially in 2023 then this live training is going to shift everything for you okay so i am going to give you the perfect pitch formula over here how to actually pitch what are the different i have a four part perfect pitch formula that i'm going to give you over here but if you feel like i want to deep dive into this and i want to learn exactly how to word everything and i want the scripts and templates and all of that then you are invited to join the perfect pitch formula masterclass that i'm doing on day after tomorrow okay so that is all the details but i want to talk about this there's been a huge shift in how people are buying in 2023 there was it was totally different totally different and easy to sell in 2022 people were buying from just from authority people were looking at how they loved a leader and they had a lot of high ticket offers that they couldn't that they didn't have the budget for right so when that high ticket offer creator actually came up with a $97 masterclass or a $97 program or something like that people were actually grabbing it right away that was kind of like you could actually sell your offers with lazy selling tactics in 2000 high in 2022 but people's buying ways has really shifted in 2023 i have seen a lot of businesses actually shutting down or decreasing their prices literally so many changes just because people are now more aware of how they are buying in 2023. So if you are, have been using, if you were making a lot of sales in 2022 and now you've seen a dip in your sales, you really need an actual way, you really need the sales psychology tacked in in your pitches that you are making so that you are making more sales. Okay, so that is what we are going to talk about today. So you need to see how, what all things you don't have in your pitches, how can you actually build all of the different parts of the pitch that I'm going to talk about today so that your pitches actually work and so that you make sales. Okay, so what we are going to talk about today is you want to think of the fir first thing, let's think of how your pitches, does your pitch have, is your pitch compelling? Is your pitch compelling? Right, I want you to ask yourself this. Is your pitch actually making your audience want to buy your offer? Because that is the first thing. If that is not there, okay, if people know that they need your offer, right? They know that I need, for example, let's, let's take a product-based example, right? For example, I know that I need a moisturizer in my life. I don't have a moisturizer at all. And I look at a moisturizer and I'm like, yes, I need that. But I wouldn't buy until I feel like I want to buy from that brand right so even though people feel the need for your offer if you have created an offer that your audience needs in their life but you're not able to build the feeling that they really want to buy that offer then again you wouldn't sell okay so let's look at the four part pitch formula and that is first thing is you want to make your audience want to buy your offer they should really feel that is the uh, you might have heard the sales psychology right and that is people buy from emotions right people buy from emotions so are you creating the emotions are you building the emotions in your audience when you actually pitch your offer right and i call this desire are you building desire for your offer so that they feel like, yes, I want to buy this, right? Yes, I want that offer. You can actually build desire even for an offer that they don't need at all, and then you can create the need. But we are not talking about that. We also want you to create an offer that they actually need and then actually build desire for it, right? So that is a different topic. But first part of the pitch formula is to build desire for the offer because we know that people buy from emotions, right? The second part of the pitch formula is you want to 
after people have bought uh, uh, after people want your offer they actually need a logical reason that this is why i'm buying if they don't have that logical reason in their brain they would be like i don't want other people to call me this is called saving the face i don't want other people to call me dumb for buying this right so that is why they need a logical reason in their brain which is why the second part of the pitch formula is building need you want to build a need for their offer you want to show them where in their life they actually need this offer right you want to show them different places different things different problems that they are going through the different symptoms signs all of it which is why they actually need your offer when you have both of these things figured out desire plus need your audience is almost sold on the product they want it and they need it they have a logical reason they have a, an emotional reason so they are going to buy but if you have both of these things figured out you will make sales but the sales would be really sporadic they would come in some day and then there would be a huge gap and then they would come in some later day you wouldn't make consistent sales which is why after these two things you have figured out there are two more parts to the perfect pitch formula and that is because people still have objections when you have these two things figured out in your pitch and that is am i paying the right price right and they are like what am what am i getting from this offer what am i getting from this offer do i need to pay this much or can i actually get it for a lower price right hi so you want to make sure that you are showing them so the third part of the perfect pitch formula is perceived value what is the perceived value you want to increase the perceived value in the eyes of your audience so that they see it as equal to the price of your product right so that is the perceived value the third part of the perfect pitch formula and then the fourth thing is i will tell you that if you give someone a long time to make a decision people would never make a decision <laughs> okay so that is why we need to have urgency you need to give them a reason for why they need to buy now and that reason can be internal reason or an external reason internal reason can be something like you are creating an internal urgency for them but they, you are showing them that you already waited too long right and you create that internal urgency and you show them you need to buy now right you you are giving them a really logical reason for why they need to buy now and that is internal reason external reason can be scarcity urgency all of those tactics right so that urgency is the fourth part of the perfect pitch formula but even though you know about these things the need the desire value and urgency even though you need you know all of these things you need to know exactly how to build desire exactly how to build how to actually increase the perceived value of your offer how to actually build need for your offer so that your audience actually sees why they need your offer why where they actually will use the offer right even though it feels really um stupid to you <laughs> that i that you actually need it and you don't need to explain to them why they need it but you have to explain it to them right so need desire value and urgency these are the four parts of the perfect pitch formula you need to know exactly how to build all of these and inside the perfect pitch formula masterclass i'm going to give you not only uh training on where to use all of hi not only training on where to use and how to use all of this and how to actually build all of these but i'm also going to give you the scripts and the templates that you can use for each part of this so that you don't have to think twice you can just plug and play all of these scripts and templates however you like but your pitches would be completely different even if you create 10 pitches from the same scripts that is the beauty of this right so i want you to ask yourself a few questions go back to all of the pitches that you made before and ask yourself is your pitch compelling is your pitch actually building need and building desire for your offer is your pitch able to increase the perceived value of your offer and the last thing is are you giving them a reason to buy now rather than later 
right and when you can do all of this in just a single pitch your pitch would be so lot such powerful that it will bring you sales and i i will give you more subtle ways that you can increase the chances of your sales inside the perfect pitch formula okay so if you feel like all of your pitches haven't been in including all of these things then you need to include all of these things into your pitch but if you're like i want to learn and i need to learn where to get all of this how to actually make your pitch compelling how to actually build desire and how to build need for the offer how to actually increase the perceived value of your offer even when you are selling a high ticket offer because i've used these this pitch formula not only to sell my 27 dollar offer but to also sell my 2000 dollar offer so it is actually proven and it will bring you sales not only for low ticket offer but also for your high ticket offer okay so no matter for which one you use you need to learn how to actually build desire how to actually build uh, need how to create your pitch compelling and interesting it shouldn't be boring right and how to actually increase the perceived value of your offer and give them a reason to buy all of this together if you don't know how to all, do all of this and you feel like yes this would make sense for me then i highly recommend that you join the perfect pitch formula masterclass that is available only for 37 dollars and it actually kicks off day after tomorrow so you will get access to it in just one day after that plus when you join now before thursday before day after tomorrow when you join now you'll get instant access to my three story pitches um yeah three story pitches that i've used so many times rinse and repeat to actually make a lot of sales so you can get access to all of these pitch templates story pitch templates which you wouldn't get if you join after thursday right so if you're actually thinking of buying you are actually thinking of joining perfect pitch formula i would highly suggest hi aditi I would highly suggest that you join Perfect Pitch Formula before this. It's only $37 to join right now. That is the whole Perfect Pitch for Formula. And to everyone who joined now, you can still go back and watch the replay in just a moment. I'm closing this replay because this live because it was such a short live. But the thing is that all of this, the, th the four part Perfect Pitch Formula, when you can actually build in all of this in your pitch your pitches will literally work and you will make sales because it's tried and tested it's proven it has worked for me and it will work for you as well not only for a small high ticket of low ticket offer but it will also work for a high ticket offer okay so i hope that this live training has given you a lot of things about a lot of things to think of how your pitches haven't been working or have been working whenever they have worked and uh, more details about what needs to be improved in your next pitches right i'll sign off thank you so much for joining